Then Slade Bolden in the slot. One of Young's favorite receivers, third and short. Pressured, and he goes down. Alabama line gives up for sack to Solomon Zuberu. It's a loss of seven. Fred Davis is at tailback, and he gets stopped in the backfield on the very first play. Byron Young lost the one. A little surprised we're seeing Fred Payton multiple series instead of Carter Peavy. Oh, Alabama got it! Bama with the puck block, looking for offense from special teams. And it'll be a walk-in for Chris Braswell. 31-yard return. Right here, and 81's supposed to step out and block him, but 81 stays inside. You can see they're supposed to bump, bump to the outside. 81 just stays right there, lets him go and run right by. That is not what you want to do when you're standing back there as the personal protector for the punt. I've the seen Anakin's there. move more than that. Yeah, he literally just, uh, I don't know if he knew they snapped it. I was going to say, I don't think he saw the snap. Yeah, he might not have. Number 91, I mean, not 81. 2,000 yards and 16 touchdowns through the air and that spread offense his senior year. That one tipped and intercepted. Kool-Aid McKintry came right through the brick wall after Drew Sanders tipped it. Your hands up, mirror his arm. Tips and overthrows, baby, that defense. And special teams coming to play here. Like a Jalen Waddle type receiver. Saban said that this week. That's a heck of a cop. They go to Robinson on the perimeter, and he slides his way through for a gain of 14 on first down. Which makes you really dangerous as an offense. Blitz coming up the middle. Robinson runs by the blitz. Steps out of a tackle and dives forward past the 20. A pickup of 13. Hand it off. Robinson and the entire pile will end up in the end zone. Touchdown, Alabama. First of the game late in the first quarter for the offense. Impose your will, will on a team that is not as athletic, not as big. Checking to see if his knee bounced down just before he crossed the goal line. Doesn't look like it. Great drive there by Al. Quick to the line. Play action on third down. Peavy, pressure, taken down. Alabama sack DJ Dale. It's a loss of four. The punting team will come out. So that was the plan for Manny Diaz in Miami last week. Game plans may be changed going forward as John Mechie shakes one to pick up the first down. Young finds Bolden. Nobody in front of him. And he goes airborne. 18 yards for an Alabama touchdown. Right goal line. Up and over. A little bit easier to do against Mercer, I mean against Furman or Chattanooga yeah. than Alabama. Yeah. Great carry on this punt from Trey Turk. Bolden from the 12. Bolden with a solid return after a great punt, 54-yard punt. Boots a fullback now. Leading the way. First down, touchdown. Jace McClellan from five yards out. Evan Neal again. Cam Latsu, Evan Neal. I'm sorry, sir. You got to go. There's another monster double team. On the left side, and Jace McClellan, a guy that Bill O'Brien told us, a true three-down back. They love his short yardage capabilities to go along with. And they said, you know what, let's go do our own thing. Second down. Peavy goes down. A shove up front. They pushed it all back for a loss of six. Nate Howard transferred from South Alabama. Pressure from the edge. Peavy pressured again. And he will crumple again for Darian Mathis. Helped out by Will Anderson. Back-to-back -back sacks. JoJo Earl set to return. That's a line drive. Earl takes it after a couple hops. He's got plenty of space on the sideline. And another electric return from JoJo Earl. This one covers 29 yards. A number of different ways, similar to the way they've used Waddle. Williams six starts over two years at Ohio State. Room on the left side now for Trey Sanders. Healthy again after numerous issues. 30-yard attempt for Will Reichert. 
everything good. And with a half minute to go in the first half, Alabama's opened up a 31 0 lead. All these game reps are so much more valuable than the practice reps. They go play action on the first play, and he delivers a bullet complete for a first down to Jamison Williams. Receiver comes straight back to the quarterback, and that's where that timing lines up. On second, they're able to find Mechie, and he's got plenty of running room. It's now a foot race. Mechie checked down by Lance Wise, a gain of 40 on the catch and run. Second and two. Looks, finds, touchdown. Jamison Williams. Has lost earlier today. Alabama not threatened by Mercer. Williams has his first touchdown today. Force him to really prepare like he's going to play every single week. Does the same with Anthony Richardson. So it's all going according to plan. And there's Wide a big open. Wow. And Devron Harper will walk it in. 60 yard touchdown pass. Yeah, absolutely. A little half roll, and they got a post going back across. Jordan Battle in coverage there just gets lost. Play action for Young. Holden with the catch. How much longer do you think Bryce Young plays? Young wants a lot. Wow, great hands by Holden. And then a fancy move at the end. And all six three of him, big body, big frame. Again, this is the this is the fourth read for Bryce Young yeah. now. Pressure coming from the linebackers. Picked up, dumped over the middle, and touchdown, Jace McClellan. Second touchdown of the game for McClellan. Front has just been dominant. Just take this in. Clean pocket for Bryce Young. We mentioned the two-headed monster that they had with Chris Leak and Tim Tebow. But those discussions. Oh, intercepted and an underthrown ball. And Alabama's got another big defensive play with a takeaway from Marcus Banks. Inside, and Marcus Banks does a great job there of pushing the receiver to the sideline and then finding the football. Remember the, the penalty by Jordan Battle yeah, earlier? Never turned around. He walled the defender. And he'll put it in the air in the first play this week. Deep post. And caught by JoJo Earl. Cole tapped me on my shoulder after a production meeting last night. He said, hey, you want to go to the sporting goods store? That's a nice leaping grab made by Ethan Durham. To throw again on second down. Wide open. Touchdown, Ty James, a former Georgia Bulldog. I used to see this a lot way back in the day, but. Boy. McKinstry just just gets lost there, especially in the past game at practice on Thursday with Jalen Milrow. On fourth and one, Milrow's going to run for a first down and plenty more. Without the view of a quarterback or listen to a play and and soak it all in, some of us, me included, need to move. He is moving. Yeah, Jalen Milrow, and and what a dynamic that brings. Not just to the run game, but then the next step, the RPO game. That he's not going to mess up, and you give him opportunities to develop his confidence and develop his on-field. Here we go. Makes one miss. And once again, they get him by the jersey. It's a loss of one. And a nice hustling play made by Mercer. And he is right back at it. Will Record has hit one in a row. New York, the Mets, and the Yankees will play. And of course, Mike Piazza hit the famous home run when sports returned to New York City. That crossing route complete for a first down. They hosted the Braves, and I talked to Chipper Jones about that moment many times. He was playing left field. Accuracy, toughness. 
pretty good qualities to have. That'll be fun to watch. Jalen will also get the start tomorrow as well. Three Alabama starters. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.